Hi guys and girls and welcome back to another video. In this video we're going to be weight painting our character. If you didn't see the modeling and the rigging episode, I will leave the links down in the description or have a card in the upper right corner. So obviously the first thing we want to do is apply some automatic weights. So right click on your mesh and then shift right click on your rig and then you can press Control P and click with automatic weights. Now if we right click on our rig and press control tab to go into pose mode. Of course this isn't perfect so we have to fix some stuff. For example the shoulder isn't good and I think the leg if we just move it up is distorting too much of our torso. Two very useful hotkeys are Alt R and Alt G and you can use those to reset the rotation and the position of your bones. So for example, if I rotate this bone and I can press Alt R to return it here. And if I move this bone, I can press Alt G to return it. While in pose mode here, right click your mesh and press control tab or just go to weight painting mode manually. If you right click on a bone, you can see the area that it affects. Now obviously for the arm we don't want it to affect our neck and our shoulder. So go up here and take the subtract tool. And then we can start subtracting some of this. Red means that it's gonna distort it the most and blue is basically nothing. So it's not gonna distort it. If you press Z you can see the verts a bit easier. So just remove the paint from the areas you don't want you don't want to move. If I move the arm, you can see where it's distorting the mesh. So down, down here at our hip and our neck. So we'll fix those two. I will go back and take the add brush and just add a little bit of weight, weight here. I want to decrease the strength here to something like 0.1. And if I add some weight here, you can see that, again, this isn't perfect if we move our arm um, to here. But I don't think we're going to be moving our arm this high because especially because we're going to have some armor here and then it's you, you wouldn't even be able to see it. Okay, so this is my final result for this part of the arm. Press Alt R to return it and now we'll just try and move this bone and this one seems to be okay. Yeah, it will work fine. The fist is working good. Yep. Now the head, we don't want our head to move any of our neck, so just take the subtract brush and just remove it, remove the paint from the neck. Again, try and move it, and we can see that it affects a bit of our shoulders. So just remove that. And that is good. The head the neck part is again affecting a bit too much here, so just remove that. That is good. This bone is kind of useless because we're not going to use it, I don't think. But we can This looks good. When your mesh is not is doing something like this, that means that none of the bones above it are moving that part of the mesh, so that part of the mesh is staying at the place. So we just have to go back here and add some weight here. And now you can see that it's moving that. Now our legs, uh, we have to use this bone to move our legs, so just press G and Z to move it up. And now we can start fixing this. 
So we definitely want to fix this part here. If you really can't see your mesh, then just uh, press B to box select and you can use the C tool just to move the rest and then you can hide these bones with H and now you can probably see easier. You can see that when we move our leg that it's kind of, well it doesn't look good and we have a little problem here. So press Alt H, go back and start fixing this. I think this is good enough. It's not perfect, but it's good. It will work. So take a look here if you want to copy it. This is mostly up to preference and how good you are and how many times you've done it. So now if you can see if we move this, it kind of scales down the, he the heel. We want to fix that somehow. We'll try and do it. Okay, this is kind of good. It still scales it, but we're not going to be moving our foot further than this. And then this part, I think I want to subtract some of this here. And this is fine also. So just select um, Alt H to unhide everything. Press Alt R and Alt G to move back where it should be. And we have uh, weight painted our character. That's it for this episode. In the next episode, we're going to be making some armor. So if you enjoyed, if this helped you, leave a like. Comment down below if you have any suggestions or uh, things that I should improve. And hopefully, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.